Welcome to The Man in the Middle. I'm your host, Bill West. Today we're going to be looking at uh, an article on metal injection about the new, uh, hopefully a new Judas Priest album coming out soon. Yeah, let's go ahead and go to the article. This is on metalinjection.net by uh, Greg Kennelty, 17 hours ago. Rob Hobart said, New Judas Priest is very potent. We've got a great bunch of new ideas for tracks, lots of really strong demos. Judas Priest is working on a new album that they compared to their 1990 classic Painkiller, in which Rob, vocalist Rob Halford says he loves quite a bit. To reiterate that point, Halford said in a recent interview, I'm not even going to try to pronounce that, that the new album is very potent. He also said that writing and releasing Firepower in 2018 really stoked the metal fires in the band, which is always great news. Now the world is opening up and we need to get back on the road because, God, we are so missing our fans. We miss seeing our fans. We miss seeing each other in person. We haven't seen each other for over a year. We do a lot of Zooms, but we haven't seen each other forever. So we can't wait to be a band together and start rehearsing and so forth and get ready for some shows. We got a great, we got a bunch of new ideas for tracks, a lot of really strong demos. He continued, it's going to be a really potent record because we know we have to follow Firepower. But I've got to tell you, Firepower turned the metal up for all of us in the band. It really gave us tremendous boost this far on. And so, as a result of that, we carried all the energy from Firepower. We carried all the energy from the shows, and we took that with us when we went into the writing sessions last March. Not this March, but last March. And you can sense it in the writing. So we have some extremely potent, strong material. Okay. All right, I don't know if you uh, have listened to the album or seen them on tour for Firepower, but I thought it was an incredibly uh, great album. I thought uh, Firepower was compared to, highly compared to uh, Painkiller, and so I'm looking forward to uh, the new album even more, if they're saying this one is even more Painkiller than Firepower. Yeah, I got to see them, I believe in, it was uh, 2019, on the Firepower tour, on the second leg of it. It's uh, there in Ontario, California. Great tour uh, with the Deep Purple opening up for them. And uh, I had hearing loss for the better part of two days after the concert because I sat right under the speaker stacks. It was just <laughs> tremendous. All right. We are... Well, that's all I have for you right now. I'll be... Uh, I think I have another... Another article to look at uh, KISS, and uh, they're believing their days are numbered. And uh, we'll see what else drops between now and then. I'm not sure what's going on. But uh, I am Bill. I am the man in the middle. You guys take care, and I will talk to you soon.